In this video, I'm going to show you how to get MW2 remastered on PC. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is download Modern Warfare Remastered. Basically, I want you guys to go on Steam. I want you guys to buy Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered. Don't worry about the price because we're going to refund it right after. Download only the multiplayer and not the campaign. Don't worry about the campaign. Get the campaign out of here. I want you guys to go to support on the game. Come down to it's not what I expected. Go to refund. Choose your method of refund after you do that go to choose refund reason and i want you guys to pick it won't start because the game actually won't even start because it gives you an error anyways go to submit and we should be good to go so that's method number one again the safest and easiest way okay now we need the h2m mod somehow some way i have to get this folder to you guys basically the file size is almost 19 gigabytes so this thing is massive mega is one of the places where i can upload this file size for free. I'm hoping you guys can just download this stuff without any problems, and I'm hoping we're all good. If not, I apologize. But yeah, I'll have the link down below for you guys to go to this website and download the mod. So now I'm assuming you guys have the game and the mod. Now what I want you guys to do is I need you guys to open up your MWR game directory folder. So for me, I'm gonna go to Steam, make sure I'm on the game, go to the gear, properties. I'm going to go to installed files. I'm going to go to browse. And now I can minimize all this baloney. So here's my game and I'm going to open up the mod, open up this folder inside and all these folders and stuff in here. I just want you guys to highlight all that and drag and drop into your game. That's all you have to do. After you do that, you can close this window. Okay, now everything should be combined. Now all you have to do now is scroll down. I want you guys to find H2M mod application. So you can either start the game from here or create a shortcut and drag that guy to your desktop. Okay, so now we can close this window. Okay, so now we have our game. And if you're playing on mouse and keyboard, you're basically set to go. You can launch this and hopefully it runs. Before we get into that though, I wanna help the controller players because I am one of them. Basically, I need you guys to go on Steam and it doesn't matter if you bought the game on Steam or not. First thing we're gonna do is go to the top left, go to Steam, go to settings. I want you guys to go to the controller tab. I just want you guys to copy these settings right here. After that, we can get out of here. Now we have to add the game to Steam. So bottom left, go to add a game, go to add a non-Steam game, and then press on browse. After that, for me, it opens straight up to my game. Uh, I'm assuming it will do the same for you. But if you don't know how to get here, go to your program files 86, go to Steam, go to Steam apps, go to common, there's our game. And in here, we go to the HM mod, double click that, and for some reason, this menu that we need is behind. Make sure you see this menu. Make sure this is checked and go to add. Now I recommend we search for it in the Steam library. I'm gonna type in H2M. Once we do that, there it is. And I'm gonna right click it and I'm gonna to add to favorites. Now it'll be in my favorites tab so it's easy to access. Now I want you guys to click on it, go to the gear, properties, controller. And I want you guys to change this option here to enable Steam input. Once you do that, make sure it says exactly what it says on my screen, enabled per game override and so on. Then you can close out of that and we should be good to go. So for me, I have my PS5 controller plugged in and all I'm gonna do, press on play and the game is just gonna launch. There's no issues, no error, no nothing. Okay, so now we're on the main menu. I want you guys to go to options, go to controls, Go to gamepad and I want you guys to enable the gamepad. Now we can go play online. Again, I'm hoping everybody's controller is working and I'm hoping your game is working too. Again, I'm no expert on my computer. It just works. Hoping it's working for you guys. A couple things here. Uh, if you go to personalization, you can change your name. After that, if you want to go find a match. So if you click in your right stick or if you use your mouse and click over here, filter servers, you will see all the lobbies. And if you click in your left stick, or you sort by ping, then you can see all the, the good lobbies and that the 999 ping down there. Again, I'm hoping everything is working for you guys. Let me know. Again, the more people we have on here, the better. If you guys have any problems, leave a comment. I probably can't help because again, I'm no expert, but maybe there's other people in the comments that can help. But yeah, that's gonna be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next video.